Hi everyone, welcome to GK Today's Current Affairs Topical Quiz. We covered the report on malnutrition in children and mothers published recently and on Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana scheme yesterday. The questions in this quiz are from those areas. If you haven't watched those videos yet, I recommend you watch those first before coming back to this quiz. The links are in the description below. I'm Mitrusha from GK Today and let us begin. Under 5 mortality rate in India now matches the global average, which is how many deaths per thousand? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is 39. So this is a drop of 30% since 2012 and more government initiatives like the Matru Vandana Yojana will help make conditions better in the future. Which of the following states are among the top 5 beneficiaries for Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana? Number 1 Rajasthan, Number 2 Andhra Pradesh, Number 3 Telangana. And your time starts now. And the correct answer is 1 and 2. That is Rajasthan and Andhra Pradesh. So, Madhya Pradesh, Andhra Pradesh, Himachal Pradesh, Dadra and Nagar Haveli in Rajasthan are the top 5 beneficiaries of this scheme. Between 1997 and 2017, the annual rate of reduction in low birth weight among newborns in India has been how much? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is B, 1.1%. The annual rate of reduction was 1.1% in India between 1990 and 2017, ranging from 3.8% in Sikkim to 0.3% in Delhi. Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana has a conditional cash amount of how much to be awarded to new mothers. And your time starts now. And the correct answer is option B, 5,000 rupees. So, Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana provides a partial wage compensation to women for wage loss during childbirth and child care and to provide conditions for safe delivery and good nutrition and feeding practices. They receive a cash benefit of rupees 5,000 in three installments on fulfilling their respective conditionality, which are early registration of pregnancy, antenatal checkup, and registration of the birth of the child and completion of first cycle of vaccination for the first living child of the family. Which state has had the highest rate of decrease in children being underweight between 1990 and 2017? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is Meghalaya. The annual rate of reduction was 3.2% in India between 1990 and 2017, ranging from 5.4% in Meghalaya to 1.8% in Delhi, where Meghalaya is the highest and Delhi is the lowest. What is the ratio of fund sharing for the Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana between the state government of Nagaland and the central government? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is 90 to 10. So the scheme is a centrally sponsored scheme under which the cost sharing ratio between the centre and the state and union territories with legislature is 60 to 40, while for northeastern states and three Himalayan states it is 90 to 10, which is why in the case of Nagaland it's 90 to 10. It is 100% central assistance for union territories that do not have a legislature. Who published the first comprehensive estimate of disease burden due to child and maternal malnutrition in India very recently? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is option D, India State Level Disease Burden Initiative. So this published the report. Now India State Level Disease Burden Initiative is a body that was launched in October of 2015. And the burden from 333 disease conditions and injuries and 84 risk factors was computed for each state of India as a part of the Global Burden of Disease Study in 2016. And recently it published the estimate of disease burden due to child and maternal malnutrition this year itself. 
Janani Suraksha Yojana is the modified version of the 1995 scheme called what? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is A. National Maternity Benefit Scheme. So Janani, Janani Suraksha Yojana was launched in April 2005 by modifying the National Maternity Benefit Scheme and it came into effect in August of 1995 as one of the components of the National Social Assistant Program. Who all are not eligible for Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana? And your time starts now. And the correct answer is all of the above, that is government employees, PSU employees and those who already have maternity benefits. So the maternity benefits are available to all pregnant women and lactating mothers except those in regular employment with the central government or state government or public sector undertaking or those who are in receipt of similar benefit under any law. So this includes all of the employees who already have maternity benefits. Which of the following are previous versions of Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana? 1. Indira Gandhi Matritva Sahyog Yojana 2. Matritva Sahyog Yojana 3. Mother Care Scheme And your time starts now. And the correct answer is B. 1 and 2 only. So the scheme was launched in 2010 as Indira Gandhi Matritva Sahyog Yojana and it was named again as Matritva Sayog Yojana in 2014 and again as Pradhan Mantri Matru Vandana Yojana in 2017. That's all for this video. If you like this video, do like, share and subscribe to our channel. And to learn more about the topics covered, simply follow the link to the daily notes videos as are in the description. Until next time, goodbye and good luck.